Yo, what is good, people? I'm back with another video, and yes, you guys see it. You guys are looking at it correctly. We have NBA 2K19 screenshots, and it is crazy. I have some crazy news for you guys right now. So, the park, the playground, whatever you want to call it, it's back, okay? It's back. So, what's going on is, they really changed the whole playground set on how it's going to be. It's all different now. Literally, there's, you know, you, you guys can see it. There's um, the Under Armour logos everywhere. I don't know why, but there is. There's a bunch of graffiti on the floor. There's beat logos. There's gates. That's new, you know what I'm saying? So the game looks pretty cool, you know, from that. The mascots, they're back. Mascots, they're back. And, you know, a lot of people are hyped for that. Me, personally, I probably won't be getting a mascot because I just don't have that type of time to play the game like that. But, mascots are back. There is also a, a huge return, but we'll get into that later. Archetypes. Archetypes are back. Obviously, the two different archetypes you can pick, um, you know, from Playmaking Sharp or whatever. Playmaking Sharp, I put that screenshot there just because they're not going to be that good, man. Playmaking Sharp shooters are just going to be pretty bad. Uh, looks like if it's not peer, if the, if the player you're creating is not a peer something, it's not going to be all that good, you know what I'm saying? And that's to be real. But... Now, and for something else, the Jordan Rec Center is confirmed. It's back. If you guys do not know what the Jordan Rec Center is, it was in 2K15. It was pretty cool, you know, 5 on 5 gameplay. But it was just super laggy with, you know, which are my players and everything. But it was just super laggy. And, you know, they took it out the for 2K16, 17, and obviously 18. And now it's coming back in NBA 2K19. And hopefully... It should be better, you know, now that they have Pro-Am, they're doing Playground, all that other stuff. Hopefully, it's not too laggy as it was, you know, back in 2K15, but it's way better now. Uh, I'm very hyped, and uh, it's going to be lit, guys. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this news. If you guys want some more news like this, drop a like on this video. I got you guys. I really got you guys. Um, sorry for the little pictures being so fast going through. If you guys just want to look at them again, just go ahead and go back in the video and just look at the images. It looks very cool. Um, if there's any more images, I will be sure to let you guys know uh, about that. Um, the prelude comes out on Friday, which is pretty lit. And if you guys want me to do this for other games, you know, just let me know. I will. Uh, what game you guys want it on. You know, Black Ops 4 is coming out. You know, I can give you guys news on that. Um, definitely going to be showing you guys gameplay. And, by the way, I will be live streaming uh, NBA 2K19 as soon as it comes out on... Well, as soon as it comes out, I'm going to be showing you guys videos of the prelude, but I'm going to be live streaming the actual game when it comes out. So, make sure you guys check that out. The link will be in the description down below for both of my, my Mixer live streaming uh, account and then as well as my twitch so check that out guys if you guys are new to the channel subscribe look at these pictures man just look at these images it's crazy we got jordan rec center back got these archetypes that you know i'm worried about i'm, I'm pretty worried because you know if you're not up here you're not going to get you're not going to get the things you want you know in order to get ankle breaker hall of fame you have to be a pure playmaker and i might do that because you know in 2k17 my playmaker was pretty cheesy man it's pretty crazy but um 2K18, I made a playmaking shot creator. He had a Hall of Fame ankle breaker badge. But, you know, it looks like if it's not pure, you're not going to get that badge Hall of Fame. So I might do that and then make a pure sharp as well. I might make two um, archetypes, two different um, players. But that's besides the point. Hopefully you guys like these images. We got Jordan Rex in back. We got the playground image. Looks pretty different. I just hate that they made it gray, but they did add a lot of more designs. Um, but I feel like they should have made it. I was thinking that people were going to be able to travel 
to different neighborhoods. So they had the Flyers back, the Ballers, and then Rivet. I thought they were going to be able to do that, but, you know, I'm fine with this. You know what I'm saying? It looks different. It looks new. So I'm hyped for this. And I'm excited. Um, so we got Jordan Rex Center back. I'm sorry for repeating myself, but I'm just going to let you guys know what we got. Jordan Rex Center. Uh, it looks like you wear jerseys and not your actual, you know, attire that you would wear to the playground, which sucks, but hey, it's whatever. So we got Jordan Rex Center Park image, the playground, obviously. We got mascots back for all those people, the players, you know, out there who want to use their mascots on the playground. That's back. And then we got the archetypes. So, um, yeah, if you guys want me to do a separate video on archetypes, let me know in the comment section down below. If you guys like this video, that would mean a lot because I'm back and better than ever to this YouTube thing because I'm telling you guys, I'm, I'm bringing you guys some lit content. I got you guys some 2K19 news early. You guys see this? You guys see this? No one has playground videos so far, all right? So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like, subscribe, favorite, share this video, and I will see you guys in NBA 2K19. I'm signing out. Peace.